Hey guys, welcome back to WP Event Manager. And in this video, we're gonna talk about Event Manager's date and time format settings. Okay, so how to access the settings page? If you ask, we're gonna go to Event Manager, then Settings in our WordPress backend side. And over here, you will find like several tabs. One of them will be the date and time format. Okay, so over here, you will find like six total settings that uh, we can divide into separate topics. So keep your eyes uh, on this channel for explanation about the other uh, settings over here rather than the date and time format and the time picker format. So today we're gonna talk about the date picker date format or time picker uh, format and we're gonna have an interactive demonstration. Okay. So firstly what I'm gonna do, let's open the front end side in your tab and we're gonna go to event dashboard and we're gonna go to the submit event page. Okay, so over here you will find a date picker. So start date and end date will have a date picker, and a time picker will be uh, on the start time and end time. Okay, so perfect way to demonstrate the changes we make over here. So what is date picker date format? Okay, so you see the default date format over here is to, uh, like the year first, then the month, then the uh, date. Okay, so for some users, they might want to change the date format for their website. Okay, so if we go over here and change the date format, like if we pick a date over here, you will see the date format over here exactly follows how it looks over here. Okay, so this is modifiable. If a user wants to like use a different type of date format in the website, they can do it and they can configure it from here. Okay, so if you click this, there will be a drop down with like multiple select options you can select from. And we give you like a vast majority of options to choose uh, the date format from. Okay, so you see like we have like a lot of combinations over here that you can use European style, uh, American style. So like with different uh, separators as well. So for the demonstration, let's say if we want to choose or like use this date format over here. So this is pretty much the Indian standard uh, date format. So if we select that one and let's click on save changes. And then we're going to switch back to the tab for later on. And we need to reload this page to facilitate the changes we have just made. Okay, so let's reload. And over here, we're going to pick a date once again. So let's select any date. And you will see now the date over here follows exactly what we set it to. So the format over here being followed over here. That's how simple it is to facilitate or like modify your uh, date picker date format for the entire website. Okay, so it's not limited to the front end side overall. You can use this date format in the back end side. So it's a global settings. Okay, but for WP Event Manager to be exact. And the same way we can use the time picker format. But unfortunately, time picker format uses either uh, 12 hours time or 24 hours time. Okay, so by default, if we uh, click on the start time, you will find a drop down over here that currently uses a 12 hour format. Okay, so how you can change that to 24 hours? You just have to select this radio button over here click on save changes and then if we reload the page so all the times over here now in 24 hours format okay so previously we saw how it looked like in 12 hour format and this is the 24 hour format if i scroll down you will be able to notice right here okay so that's how simple it is to modify your uh, wordpress website's date picker date format or the time picker format when using WP Event Manager. So I hope this video gave you a bit of idea or like customization tip. If you like this video, leave a like, leave a comment, share this video and all that good stuff. Until next time, I'm sure saying goodbye. Thank you for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.